What's up guys? This is Mad Squash 924 here and welcome to Dead by Daylight. So let's last week when we played Dead by Daylight, we played as I believe um we played a Leatherface game I think and we played a Michael Myers game I believe. This week we're gonna try out the Huntress. Haven't played the Huntress before for you guys that are watching this. Um so that's why I'm level three with her. Never played her. Uh, I know the gist of her. I've versed many of them before. However, I've not actually versed one. Um, the thing I have on her, I got the thing that gives her 75% more blood points. Um, what else do we have? We have this, which adds a little toxin for 30 seconds. A little, you know, exhausted effect, I suppose, um, for 30 seconds. We also added this other thing if we hit the hit target suffers from a hindered status effect for 15 seconds i mean it seems okay i guess um but the perk that we chose that i chose anyways is called hex huntress lullaby and you guys can read what it does if you don't know what it does you can pause the video i'll leave it on here for a few seconds just so you can guys get the gist of it while we're waiting for a couple other survivors to jump right in um but from what i understand the huntress she's pretty basic I guess, um, uh, for her, like ab actual abilities, she uses her left trigger to, at least for the Xbox version, she uses her left trigger to hold the axe, and then you chuck it, and we start with five hatches, hatchets, you know, um, and I guess we can refill our hatchets, um, at different lockers that we find around in the map, so, yeah. That's pretty much the all I can really say of her, really, that I've experienced with her. I mean, she's annoying. I know there's... Excuse me. I know there's perks that will make it so um, if she throws a hatchet at you, she can instant down people, but I don't have that. I th and it's, it's something that um, somebody else that I know that plays this game uses that a bunch. However, I don't have that. We just, we're just level 3. We're just starting out with the Huntress. And we're going to see how this plays out. As long as this other person readies up. There we go. And let's see how we do it. How we do. Okay. Yep. Okay. Everything's just blood point related. Nothing really affects the killer. Nothing really affects the survivor. So... Yeah, and as as we do, um, there's this little loading screen. This never changes, and the other loading screen for the survivors never changes. I wish this would like vary up, or like change in some way, or change in the way that it like it is relevant to per killer. You know, that'd be kind of cool, but it's not. So it's whatever. Um, so one thing I'm gonna have to learn pretty quick, pretty quick, like is. The length and like the max range the Huntress can throw her axes because I have no idea how far she can actually throw them um, at her current state because I've seen people yeet those things across the damn map. I've seen them totally whiff things, you know, and I've seen them be pretty fast and I've seen them be, you know, like averagely quick. So I got to like figure out the range of those hatchets. If I can get those down, I think we should be do fine. Um, other than that, I'm going to have to hit them with a basic or probably try to lunge at them. But that's the idea with what I'm going to go with. And um, I don't know what map we're going to be on. We'll see in a second. Um, yeah. Um, hopefully this goes well for me. And as we've been doing for the last few episodes now, um, once we do this killer uh, match, we'll switch over to Survivor or play Detective Tap. Um, I'm pretty close to getting Prestige 50 with him. I'm really close. I think I'm like three or so levels away. I could be a little bit off by that, by that number, but I think I'm, I'm, I know I'm really close. Long story short. And the loading times in this game, man, they're atrocious. They're just, just, just making me talk and talk and I've run out of things to say. And the game's like, nah, we're still gonna, we're still gonna make you wait. I'm like, wow, that's a cool game. Glad you're doing that. And like, yeah, we're nice this way. So yeah. All right, let's get it. Torment Creek and Coldwind Farm. Okay. 
So first thing I gotta do, I wanna see how far this I can eat this thing. Pretty quickly, pretty far. Okay. That was the thing I wanted now. Okay, let's go get her. Well, they already destroyed my hex, so that's not good for me. So they're right on top of things. And I'm not throwing this very good at all. In fact, I'm playing pretty poor. Just kind of losing them. Try to shut this down. Oh! There we go. And there's a hook right over there. We'll just bring it right over here. Unfortunately, we're out of hatchets. But we'll go get some more. And I, because I suppose it shows us, like in this. Beautiful, look at this. All right. Scones, start searching for more peeps. you up. And uh, I do want to get rid of this hooky. Um, well, not this hooky. Um, this. Oh, I can't hurt this more. Huh? Oh, where did they go? I see the stains. Wow, he's glitchy all over the place. Okay. That damn, that person got off his hook. We'll put him on this hook. We took kind of a long way to get it this way, but whatever. And now that that's going on, we'll go back to this, to um, this generator since it's basically done. So I imagine they're here, you know. Somewhere. Hmm. 
They screwed up a little skill check, so we're gonna walk over there. Damn it. They're doing really well. I'm doing also really poor. They are on top of these generators. Like nobody business. Alright. Not for you. There you go. Have fun. You're dead. At the very least, we killed one of them. We're not going to get all of them. We're just going to check this generator because they're going to be working on this. For sure. We'll grab more of these. Perfect. Oh! Yeah, and. Destroy this. We'll go this oh! one. Gotta make sure they don't get these done. There we go. I can kind of loop this so I know where they're gonna be at. Sorta. Break this word come for. Let's go back to this Jenny. Gonna just knock her at this point. I can't be, ha I can't afford for this to happen. That one's good. We're searching here for more of these. I would like put them on a hook, but like I don't have time. You know? Somebody else disconnected. So I got more of a chance to win this one now. Hmm. Where are they? One can wonder. That one's still not going. This one's still not really going. So we got to go back. 
there's no other generators for them to get. It's all, and they've been only working on this one, so... I'll come back here. I'll break this when I have to. At this rate, it might only be one game. Maybe two. Somebody's working on this one. this so they can get that generator done. I can't let that to happen. Good, that one's getting, this one's still being degenerated. I mean, this is a really bad game for me and for them. Because I can kind of loop this. You know? And the one over on the left I know isn't being worked on. Go. Uh, uh, We're just gonna pick you up now. Uh, 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 Break this. He's got one other friend somewhere. Don't know where. He could be hiding by the hatch all I know. He might have found the hatch, you know? Definitely don't know where he is. Hmm. Where could you be, young one? I'm gonna break this thing again if I can. Nope. Well, your friend never came. I don't know where he is. Where are you? He escaped. Yeah, he's by the hatch. Just like I thought. Okay. So we got three out of four. One of them disconnected. That's not awful, but it's not great. Yeah. Not bad, because I mean, it's okay considering I've never played her before. But I don't know. Maybe I'm just, you know, naive. All right, we're going to go back to the lobby. We'll put some blood points into the Huntress a little bit for for our next time we eventually do her. Um, and then we'll go over to Detective Tap. But yeah, it was interesting. Like, she's inter she's sort of interesting, but she's kind of hard to aim at that with that thing. Like, you definitely got to be really on point and really good with the, with the uh, hatchet throws, you know? I mean, obviously it wasn't the best. I missed probably like 80% of those shots. Like, I, mi I missed a lot. Like, I'm I'm obviously not good with it. You know. 
start working towards the, you know, the perks and then everything else that we can get to. Get this. Can't get that, so we'll get nothing, I suppose. And that will be it for you. That was fun, Huntress and all, but we're gonna go and use the remainder of our time to play as good old Detective Tap. Where he's very tappy. Oh, he's level 43, my boy. He's pretty close. I don't even know what we have on him, you know? We got a key. I didn't know we even had a key on him. We'll put these things on him. And then we'll use the offering when we get into the game lobby. All right. Let's see. Okay, I see you. And then, let's see, we'll use an offering. Hmm, let's, uh, I don't know. Let's moderately thicken the darkness for once. We don't really do that a whole lot. At least I don't. I don't, I don't know, the thickness of the, of the fog doesn't seem too applicable. Like, it doesn't seem all that important and to my personal taste. Like, I don't think it does much. I mean, he used it too, so it's gonna be really thick. For the killer and for us you know so the killer should have a harder time trying to find us he'll he'll go based off of the generator noises it i mean it also depends which killer we're versing as well you know um it could also be a deficit to us say if we're versing like something like the trapper it'll be really hard to see i imagine it'll be hard to see the bear traps even harder than it is already because they're already kind of hard to spot as it is same with the hag hex, the hag hexes that are all over the place. I can hardly see them, and I when I'm you know when there's no fog of war. So yeah. But other than that, I don't know. The um. I also imagine the hunters would have a harder time trying to hit our shots because it's it's a lot foggier. At least this this round would be a whole lot foggier than it is usually. So there's that. Didn't really see who our allies were. I think I saw a couple Claudettes and then there was another guy. I can't remember his name. Um, I didn't really I don't remember what their ranks were either. I don't so I don't know if they're decent or not. I imagine they are. I imagine they're fine, you know. As long as we don't go to the laboratory, I think we'll be fine. I mean the hospital sucks, but the laboratory is just awful, you know. And I think we even went to the laboratory in the last episode, I believe. Can't recall, though. Ah, oh, we're, we're at the preschool. The preschool's really fun to be at. I think it's fun. We're already at a generator, so let's work on it. Somebody is targeted. And the killer is nearby. Don't know who the killer is. Don't like it. Mm-hmm. Who's the killer? They're running around. They're, they just hit the thing I was at. Oh, it's another face. Why would it not? Oh, of course he found me. Okay, that's cool. Great start. Glad the Leatherface was just there. You know? So it doesn't help that not only did we start basically next to Leatherface in this one, but um, he's coming too. It sucks. Not only did we start next to Leatherface, but this is going to be bad. Also, I thought he was going to run in there more. I totally didn't think he was going to be there. 
this point, we're already just running around like a dude. Oh, my. We're already kind of a bass. Oh, I didn't realize we had a generator done though already. That's nice. You know, that's always good. Let's start repairing this Jenny. I don't even know if there's a hex room on this thing or not. There's not, thankfully. Hopefully that that Claudette can go get her out. I was hoping that he was gonna do that while he was distracted. I don't know what Claudette's doing. Oh good. Get him off. <laughs> well, on the brighter side of things, we got him off. So that's good. Let's go back to this generator. I was gonna go help that guy, but uh. Ooh. And he's gonna be hooked again. Damn. I mean, I got him already, so maybe they can get him this time while I'm getting this generator, you know? They And they do good. This generator got done in the process of all that commotion. That's good. It's always a good thing. Now, let us head to another generator. A generator of pure potential. A generator that will probably bring us no closer to victory. And I'm talking about the one upstairs over here. Let's start working on it. We'll have to be mindful of Leatherface. We'll have to be mindful of these skill checks, of course. But I think we should be able to get this thing as long as... Yeah, he's distracted, so we should get this. You know? I mean, we're looking pretty solid so far. Very nice. Oh, that's unfortunate for him. Yikes. That guy can't get hooked hookied again or he's it's over. And he's gonna get hookied. Sorry guy. You know I, mm, that sucks. I hate I know how it doesn't be that guy. It's over for him. There's two generators left. We just gotta find them. They're over there, I imagine, for sure. So let's start working our way there. That one's done. Let's check the one in the basement here, see if there's one down here that needs to be finished. Needs to be started even, you know? Let's, let's get it done. Oh, jeez. Poor fellow. Where is he? Eh, he's kind of close. He's sort of close. 
Generator's half done, thankfully. He's giving us plenty of time to get this generator done. I don't know what our ally's doing. I don't know if he's gonna get him off. Yeah, he does. Good. That's what I was kind of hoping. It was I, was I was either gonna hope for that, or he was working on generator and it was almost done. That that's just as good, honestly. This does give me more time to work on the generator. You sneaky bitch. I think he has to go up, though, to hook me. Yeah, he does. And he's really close. He could do it. Let's see how this works out. He's gonna go hit the generator, and then while that's happening, she can come get me. Or not. Or be seen by him. That sucks. There you go. There you go. Please get me, young fellow. Fellow knights of the round table, please come and gather my belongings. I do not like to be healed, if you would kindly heal me. Right here. Behind this. Here is fine. It shall do. Um, yeah. Uh-oh. Oh my gosh! He's just a big dummy. It's over. It's time for us to get killed. <sighs> that was gross. Oh well. Can't win them all. We got pretty close. There was two generators to be completed left. Um, you know, we completed two of them alone. Um, we almost got a third one done. Um, but yeah, we do have that. They're probably gonna, they're probably okay. They might win. But um, I get to keep my key because of the item that I brought with me, so that's good. Let's see how many points we get. Oh, good. We got, we uh, gained a rank. That's always. That's always nice. Yeah, we didn't get that many points. Uh, what can you do? But on that note, that's going to be it for this episode of Dead by Daylight. We'll, we'll end it on this as I'm talking. Um, if you guys like this episode, feel free to leave a like, leave a comment. Tell me you guys think of the episode. Um, on the next episode, we'll play as a different killer that I've never played as before. And then... Um, uh, we'll go based off of that, and then um, if you guys haven't already, feel free to subscribe to me, Mad Squash 924 and to ring the bell to get notified of my future videos. And I'll see you all in the next episode of Dead by Daylight tomorrow. Have a good one, guys.